But if you start at 30, how much are you going to raise it? You might get to 35. Mm -hmm. Or 40. 40. You're probably not going to go from 30 to 40. But if you start at 50, okay, and now maybe you're 55, maybe it's 60, maybe it's 65. You're going to, over the life of your career, you're literally looking at thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars difference just because you took the time to learn how to say that'll be $250. Mm -hmm. So it's like we're shooting ourselves in the foot going to work by ourselves for our whole career. Right, right. I don't think that's where anyone needs to start anyway. You need to learn. If you're just coming out of school, don't go at it by yourself because there's a lot you don't know. Like you were saying, definitely go to a commission salon or definitely work at an upscale salon or something for sure so, so you get that experience. Because I feel you with the whole, like, so you go work at Great Clips and you do a $15 cuts all the time. And then you go from a $15 cut place to your own suite. You already have that cheap discount mm -hmm. price utility. So I feel you there. I hadn't really thought about it that way. Like when you come out of school, work, you know, try to work at somewhere that's more upscale so you can really learn. But either way it go, work somewhere where you can learn because everybody wants to be the boss. And what you'll realize is, is sometimes you're, you, you may be just good making your money, doing what you love and getting out. Then they have to deal with owning a suite, owning a salon, paying the bills, getting the customers. You're not only, you're doing everything. So you're the CEO of everything. You're doing marketing, you're doing social media, you're doing following up with the clients. You're, you know, hiring people to come in. You're doing all these things. There's, it takes a lot to do those things. And sometimes that might not be fitting for your personality. Sometimes that might not be for you. And that's okay. You could make really great money as a beauty professional working at a great salon. Don't, don't think you ha everybody has to be the boss.